Come Talking of Florida men, we found the final boss of Florida men, <laughs> Lieutenant Dan. Oh, Lieutenant Dan. Some but, boy. Bro, you know what? I actually was like fucking with him at first, but now nah, I don't know the vibe now. Mm. Seen a couple of vids where bro just dropping a few words. Just dropping a few dimes. So, so essentially, yeah, there was this lad called um, Terence uh, Con Cannon and he was yep. walking from university or to or from uni, one of the two. So he saw a boat that was being pushed out to sea, a little sailboat. Yep. And he helped <clears> this guy in this boat come back to land. Yep. And this was the start of Lieutenant Dan because he gave him that name, Lieutenant Dan, obviously based off Forrest Gump character. And then during the whole... Uh, Hurricane Milton he refused to leave his little sailboat on the bay and then obviously everyone was getting really worried for him like, oh, you're going to die the fucking waves are massive the the wind is ridiculous um, and then yeah, he just thought no nah, I'm going to cut about and chill didn't realise he had one leg yeah he's got one leg yeah by the way the Lieutenant Dan thing was so misleading not his fault because <clears throat> he actually did a video saying he's not a veteran or anything like that but I thought he was no no it's just nicknamed after Forrest Gump because yeah. there's a guy in Forrest Gump who's got one leg and he's like a proper nomad. And his name is Lieutenant yeah. Dan. Oh, see, I ain't seen the movie in ages, so I forgot yeah. all about that. Well, I didn't know that until I looked up about this. But yeah, it's mental. Like, he um, he is, like, if you look at him, if you pull a photo of him up, he looks like the Florida man you've seen in all the articles. Yeah. There was, um, there was a bit of, like, fake, I think fake news going around where it was, like, an image of, like, him being arrested, like, 15 times. Have you seen that? No. Nah. All his mugshots. Of I like, think, but I, I don't think, honestly, but these Florida men look the same. Apparently, though. it's not him, and somebody photoshops him. Oh, this, so this is a real person <laughs> with real mugshots. But apparently, it, it wasn't. does look like him, bro. But but the thing is, I said, how can it be fake? Like, how could it be Photoshop when, to be fair, they're all mugshots of him? Look, are we surprised though? So this bloke lives in I his boat really, on his yeah. own and refused to leave. One of the biggest storms Mate, in there. To be fair, this history. is from the New York Post, so it's a pretty legit thing. So I think maybe it must be real. What, yeah. What do you think? I mean... Yeah, that must be real. I'd, understo- I'd understand if it was the same image of him, but it's not. They're all different mugshots. So he well, must so have he had got, taken at one point. He got a kick deal, didn't he? He got a kick streaming deal. Fuck off. Yeah, apparently... Did you not see about this? He got a kick streaming yeah. deal, but he dropped the N-word in his first stream and got it cancelled. <laughs> Great. Can we can we verify that? I, I, I don't okay, want to speak so here, bad on I, his name. I, I, I think that's true, but I don't know if it actually got cancelled so lieutenant dan did a whole video saying yeah it's been cancelled he offered it to me he brought me the 100k it must be all gone now blah 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 he's pulled it out said he saw my history and he sh- and he was like you should have done your you know due, di- due, due diligent I always i can't to say fucking that. say that word, bro, yeah and um then i think aiden ross replied saying it's not true i never said that or something like that but it yeah, might no now it him. might now be fully confirmed because that's four hours ago. Has he sat off yet? I was thinking yeah. this, yeah. All these American streamers, like you see, like okay, so he has confirmed he's sacking it off. Yeah, Is right. That, yeah, right. Okay, first. All these American streamers, like Aiden Ross, yeah. The geezer makes so much money, but the amount of shit that he has to deal with, like that geezer's probably getting like so much shit day to day. Do you know what I mean? Like grief from people in public. And stuff, yeah. He kind of just don't care really, does he? He just uh, kind of sends it. Like I was locked into his, one of his streams and he just, he just does his own fucking thing. Like he says the R word, he don't give a shit. Yeah. Very different reaction in America. Like over that. that. I feel like it's sort of like one of these things, you know, in women's football. Yeah. How when they shoot, yeah, the goalkeepers no. are smaller. So yeah. there's more room to, sh- to shoot. Yeah. In America. Yeah the goals are bigger because there's more people. So if you shoot something, there's more chance it's going to hit someone that likes it. Do you know what I'm saying? Whereas in the UK, the pool is smaller. So therefore, if you do something and you do something bad, it's going to be like reverberated and people are going to be like, right, this guy's a prick or I really don't like this guy. I don't like his content. Whereas in America, you could do the same thing. But there's more chance of it hitting the right market because there's so many more people. But, but there's more chance of it hitting the, the wrong market too because there's so many more people. But it doesn't matter because you've got the right market. You might have missed eight out of ten of those markets, but you've got two of them. It, Whereas in the UK... So also very like right versus left, isn't it? Yeah, I guess. Like if like Aiden Ross probably got a bit of a right wing audience that are a mm. little bit more like... Yeah. I would say his audience is probably more our incel, would you say? Yeah, but I feel like that it goes a little bit hand in hand. Mm. Not disrespecting that, that side of politics. Just, just, just um, incels... 
do incels exist anymore? Like they're kind the, of like freedom and say what they want, you know, free speech. That because you know like, how like we had stuff. that 4chan era. I could be waffling. <laughs> you know, like 4chan era. Yeah. So where incels were like at their peak. I think that's red exists, pill, though, red right? pill sort of yeah. mentality. Yeah. Does that still exist? Yeah, 4chan. Because I feel like it's so common now. It's almost like not a thing. Like the amount of shit online, it feels like that is the norm now. I think Twitter's just like that, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, I don't even think Twitter, like TikTok, Reddit. Yeah, anywhere online, because that kind of attitude really, you can get away with online. You can't mm. really walk around day to day acting like that. But yeah, though, this this whole Lieutenant Dan thing's crazy, because like, that just proves to me anyone can get famous. Do you know what I mean? Anyone can get <laughs> well, famous. Well, I mean, we've, it keeps happening. We had Hawk to a go. Yeah. Have you watched her pod yet? Yeah, it's fucking class. I'm, I love, I love it. <laughs> I feel I like it's it's like the fellas pretty, pretty much, but like women, but like women. It's brilliant, mate. Just a load of fucking oh, shit, man. <laughs> like when we did our thing reacting to Hot Tour, the comments were like, "This ain't much better, boy." <laughs> <It's so laughs> oh, true. This is rich, <laughs> and I was just sat there like, "Nah, hold my hands up. You fucking right." How like, crazy that I've people. almost been working with you for three years. Yeah, that's a bit mental. To yeah, me. I was thinking this the other day because obviously we had a new like head of production join the company. Yeah, and I was chatting to him, and I just feel like, "Fuck, man, I've seen so many different phases at this place." Yeah, you've do you know what I mean? Oh. It's like um, oh, brother. It's like when you've got like Aspilicueta in the Chelsea team, and he starts off as this young prospect. Yeah, and then like by the time he's like, you're right, you need to move on. Like. You're a bit like Marcus Rashford for me, right? So now. I've fallen off. No, no, <laughs> no, he's coming back. He's on a comeback right now. He's back. Mm, questionable. Streets are saying he's back against Barnsley, wasn't it? Oh, uh, please, please pull up his who scored. You'll see a goal and assist every now and then. He might be back. Come on, tap it in. Let's have a look. He scored against Barnsley and he scored in the Champions League as well. Please respect my man. He's looking good. Like he looks like he's playing well, you know? Looks like one of the more alive players yeah, in the team. Yeah, go on. You were saying. I was saying if you like Marcus Rashford because, you know, he's been here for a long time. I remember where I was when he fucking, I think it was Mourinho. Or, well, when he or scored Mourinho against um, Mitchelland. <laughs> The hat remember. trick. Did he get a hat trick against Mitchelland, wasn't it? No, in the Europa first, League. Did he get two in no. the Europa League. Yeah, it was and against Mitchell in the Premier League. Yeah, it was real. I think I was in fucking France when it happened, and I was like, "Who's this lad? It's fucking class." Mm. He was so like skinny at the time, and like raw, and he just so he just take the take the fucking. Oh, you're skinny. No, he said he was skinny at the time. Yeah. Oh yes, yeah, so I was fat. Yeah. Now, oh, that's true. Actually. Yeah. So you're it's the now. opposite. Now you're both in good shape. But yeah, he was skinny at the time. Now he's like some he's, fucking he's wham lad. And he's like, he's like the face of United now. It's so weird. You would never really expect that. Yeah. What's he got? What we're saying there? Seven appearances, one, one goal. Got, Let's got fucking goal. go. That and can't he's be. He's got one and an assist in the. They're saying, this ain't looking too good for me. Two and an assist. Oh, to the, be fair. Yeah. So how many goals has he got this season so far? Two. Four. <laughs> Four. And how many assists? <laughs> Three. Is that? No. Two. <laughs> So six GA, seven games. Like, come on, let me stat pad this one. Seven games. Not seven games, mate, because he's played, oh, he's played two in the Europa League. Nah, I don't like one your website the there, Pat. I'm not fucking what, with your transfer website. transfer market? Nah, one of the nah, nah I, I know transfer market, but you know what? I know the guy that runs it. He just fucking sometimes just messes around with the numbers. <laughs> just pops a little just goal in me. 